Would you rather pay $650 or $66 for a smartphone? Simple. With the Appalachian Advantage plan, pay less up front and then just a few dollars more every month. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. We've had such an opioid epidemic here, not only in eastern Kentucky, throughout the state, but across our country. And we here at UPIC are looking to ways to make a difference. And one of those, of course, is through education. Um, we were uh, blessed enough to receive a grant from the uh, uh, Family and Cabinet Health um, that we can provide Narcan training to those, not only in the community, but also to our students. So as part of that grant, we will be providing educational experiences here on campus. Those sessions include both uh, in-person training sessions through our simulation program here at UPIC. Uh, it'll include uh, American Heart Association dedicated training certificates. And that program will also include and allow us to be able to put four Narcan stations across our UPIC campus, which, you know, if, if needed, it could provide possibly a way to save someone's life. So we're very excited about that. As part of the training, we will train not only medical students here at UPIC, we'll be training our optometry students, we'll be training our nursing students, and our social work students. We also open it up to other faculty and staff members here at UPIC. Um, we also have community members involved, both uh, fire, uh, EMS, police, so we have multiple community organizations that we'll be able to provide this training for, and we're very excited about that. We want to make sure people are educated not only on how to administer the Narcan, and for all of those who are part of our training sessions, they'll get to practice. And that's very exciting for us. We want people to feel comfortable administering the Narcan. But as part of that too, we also talk about other parts of Narcan administration, including the dangers that go along with Narcan administration. Um, you know, these patients, unfortunately, uh, by the time that you use this, typically may be unconscious and by the time that this medication works, there are certain dangers associated both for the patient, but also those who administer the medication. So we just want to make people aware of those uh, around them and what entails and to help people be prepared in case they're put in those type situations. Anyone that's interested in this type of training, we're more than happy to get you in and, and make sure you're part of this exciting opportunity.